If you don't know what's changed with the Nike Limited runs compared to years prior, spoiler, it's not as nice as it was before, but I go into detail with it in the video right here. But just to summarize it, they changed it to Vapor Fuse, which is a different build than years prior. Most people will not like it. This out. When we check out the details, those who have been buying for years and just know the stitch down limited runs, you guys are gonna be upset. We got the Vapor Fuse limited run. So checking out the jersey, you can see right here, pretty much the same base as years prior. Nothing changes on that aspect. But the big part right here, you see the nameplate, if you don't catch it right now, but these are not stitched down. So they've become a heat press version now. So limited runs going forward, it's gonna have that heat press, kind of like the uh, NBA Swingman jerseys or the Nike replica MLB jerseys you can see right here, all heat pressed. But it's still beautiful, but you know, for those who have been buying it for years and they had a stitch down version, it's definitely hard to do, to like justify a purchase, especially for that type of price. Beautiful jersey though. Um, man, just the details have been downgraded. So 18, got that like screen printed like sleeve, but still stays the same with the embroidery on the Nike logo. They gotta make sure that stays on. You can see right here, nameplate, everything's pretty similar. Just the way they build the numbers and lettering. Then we got the front side. So there's still a couple different changes you can see right there on the shoulders, the numbers, heat pressed. The little area right here on the collar, they made a design change so it's different from years prior, a little chain mail look same nfl shield still got like that plastic kind of reflective material they did make a change inside here it's kind of a heat press it's like a thinner piece than years prior so they kind of change that on the tags you know tags 175 Ugh. pretty much same stuff um and then we got 18 just like the back so you don't need to show you that, but they also did change the jock tag down here. I personally like the old ones. I thought they were nice. Man, I just, I feel like they downgraded on this aspect. It kind of looks more uniform with the other leagues jerseys with the jock tags, but man, they downgraded because those jock tags before just look nice, man. And they're thicker. And this is what it looks like when you wear it. So. When it comes to sizing, it feels like years prior, I don't think anything really changes on there or if they did, very minimal and you can't even notice it. But it's just like old limited runs where it's kind of tight. You can see when I just do this motion, it's pulling on the sleeves. Like just a little motion like this, like you can see it's like tighten on the back. Pretty much like the last ones. It's still a beautiful jersey, but if you've bought years prior's versions, it's hard to downgrade. So you go from a stitched limited run to a heat press version, no one's gonna like it. That's a tough sell, especially if you increase the price and downgrade the quality. Like, that's a tough sell. But if you've never bought one of these limited runs, I mean, it's nice, objectively. Like, if you've never bought it, like, this is a step up from the game jerseys, but man, at 170, it is a steep price to pay. You're paying after taxes and shipping 200 bucks for a heat press version. Uh, that's a tough one. It is what it is at this point, just because this is the route they're going. They pretty much did that for all their sports. So it was only a matter of time, like that limited run was gonna turn into a heat press. And then they have the like premium tier, the elites, and then you're paying a ton of money for it. But man, I mean, still nice. It's just not as nice as getting a stitch down version, right? And that's pretty much a jersey. I also have a Nike Vapor Fuse Elite that is coming in of the same jersey. So I'm gonna check it out, compare the two, and uh, see what it looks like. Cause they're doing Vapor Fuse for the Elites. Hopefully they don't screw that up. I mean, it's still nice, but man, why is it so expensive? 